Welcome to the Home Show. It's a very special episode today because I'm joined by my panel of guests. Thank you. <laughs> to my right, I have owner extraordinaire of Yoga Hut International. International. <laughs> Soon to be international. Yoga Hut International. And to my left, I have. my name. Oh, <laughs> Jennifer Coates. Hi. My sister. And to my left, I have Ryan Brown of Archaeological Fame. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan is an archaeologist, <clears throat> one of Jennifer's adventure buddies, yes, one of her colleagues. Ryan comes to us today from California, and he is our house guest, and we are glad you are here. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, <clears throat> so we have an actual topic to speak about today. Um, as you may or may not know, Donald and I, we will say, hopped over to Hawaii. We took a jaunt to Hawaii. We took a jaunt to Hawaii last, last weekend. Weekend jaunt. It's for lunch, right? <laughs> it's for lunch. <laughs> they were craving some good pineapple and some warm weather. Took a jaunt. A week ago, we took a jaunt mm -hmm. to Hawaii. And I, I had no idea how passionate people were that it's apparently unacceptable to hop over to Hawaii for a brief um, three-day visit. Yeah. <clears throat> Apparently, weekend get getaways are not in vogue at the moment. The weekend getaway, I have decided, has become extinct. No, I thought it became extinct yeah. because, well, we'll discuss more. But um, I would say four out of five people, maybe nine out of ten people that I said, or they said, oh, how long are you going for, or when we were there, how long are you staying for, or after we got back, how long were you there for? Yeah. Or wait, you're back so early. Yeah. Why, why, why are you still here? Why are you back? Ridiculous. Why would you go so far? For, why would you drive? Why would you fly for five hours for just a few days? Everybody had a fit, a huge fit. Mind you, these are mostly people who will drive four hours to go to Spokane. Not Spokane, but like, or not sorry, Spokane, Seattle, yeah. and, you know, yeah, or for a weekend jaunt when for one hour yeah. more. Yeah, like the Oregon coast, you can get to Hawaii. Yeah, and everybody yeah. has something to say about it, about it being so short. And I didn't know it was going to be a big deal. And for, um, first of all, for Don and I, it made sense to make this a brief trip because, A, I was planning it without him knowing, and so I didn't know what his vacation time looked like at work. B, I have Elizabeth to take into consideration because she's not like other kids where you just drop them at the neighbors. She has um, special needs that were met by a certain somebody, <laughs> by a very special aunt. <laughs> and my mom, who came all the way from California, <laughs> special <laughs> grandma, a special grandma came yeah. all the way from California to watch them. <clears throat> so we really couldn't go, and we have a lot of things planned, so I didn't want to go too long, but I thought the idea of a nice Hawaiian weekend getaway was seemed really magical. Quick, it's fun, Yes. little to pack, plan, just go, enjoy, and then you also don't get tired. You don't Sometimes get tired. you're on a long trip. It's exhausting. That's and when you all travel a lot. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Ryan gets exhausted. Ryan is on his way to New Zealand in a few weeks. And then Hawaii after that yeah. for how many days? Uh, both of those a week long trip. Oh, a week long, long, long trip. He's doing it the <laughs> right way. <laughs> and we thought it was so, I don't know if it's ironic or just coincidence, that when we plan to have our kind of like, you know, discuss this this weekend getaway thing. Ryan is here on a weekend getaway. Ryan is trying to <laughs> Ryan's on a weekend getaway to my house yeah. in California. Sometimes it's not so just it's about the location, it's the people. <laughs> yeah. So. <laughs> and we had people to visit. Yeah, exactly. Thank you, Libby and Damon, for letting us stay. Anyways, I it was surprising though how many people thought it was ridiculous that we would go for just a few days. I thought it was great to go for a few days. I think it's, like you said, less yeah. stressful. Mm -hmm. You throw a few things in the suitcase and mm -hmm. you go. When uh, Donald and I uh, and the girls go on big trips a lot, ones where we're gone for a few weeks, and that's the exhausting kind because you're planning who's taking care of the animals, you're canceling, you know, mm -hmm. the mail. So beyond that, we're surprised at how many people feel, are saying, but that's a once-in-a-lifetime trip. Oh, like, that's a big one. Good Lord, <laughs> let's not, let's not hope that way. It's going to another state for a once-in-a-lifetime trip. Well, ridiculous. Yes, and on that same note, last summer when we went to Italy, yes, I was talking about it with somebody beforehand, and they said something about, this is, 
a trip of a lifetime. This is this is a trip of a lifetime. Enjoy yourself and no, 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 thing. No, I was no, like, no. oh, this stuff. No, it will be. Time. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it's the first time. That would be really depressing to think it was the trip of a lifetime. It can't be yeah. over. So we're just a little like just surprised and discouraged yeah. by people's. Uh, lack of thinking outside the box yeah. in regards to vacations and trips and adventure and and why is it this huge ordeal or why does it have to become a huge ordeal to to go anywhere? Oh. Yeah. And this week when I've had all these people saying to me, why didn't you go longer? Why is it so short? <clears throat> I finally came up with a good answer to that. I was like, well, it's just mm -hmm. a plane ride. That's all it is. Mm -hmm. And I think a lot of people don't realize you can go anywhere in the world. Just yes. The whole world is right. a plane right away. It really exactly. is. Exactly. It's a plane exactly. right away. He'll be in New Zealand. <laughs> what? In a week and a half. In a week and a half. And that's awesome. We have to you like do a guest post. We're also tired, so this is <laughs> kind of well also when we were going when we went to Italy with our sister in the summer, mm. people that came back from the trip, people asked how long I was there and I mentioned, Well, I was with my sister longer. in Italy for nine days. After she had been in Bali for two months. <laughs> And then, no, I was there for two months. Well, I was there almost two months. And then uh, Ryan here met me. Um, we decided to meet a certain day in front of the Pantheon. <laughs> it's really nice having friends who can call us or email and be like, hey, meet me this day in front of the Pantheon. And they email back, I'll be there. And that's pretty cool. So first, get yourself some cool friends and then go travel. But anyways, going back, when I told people, oh, my sisters were there for nine days and they went home, they're like, oh, they were only there for nine days. Oh, like, I know. Oh, like, really? Like, I know. I was How long have you been there? I know. Which goes back to our other comment. What did you do last weekend when Lisa was in Hawaii? Seriously. Like, what? I'd rather. TV. Tea. Tea. Yeah, TV. Like, I don't know, know. where you probably Porter. the Walmart or watching, something. Watching Hoarders. Watching Hoarders. <laughs> <Washington Porter. laughs> like, oh, God. So, um, so, people, stop hating on the weekend getaways. Yeah. Go have one of your own. Please. And before we close out this home show, um, mm -hmm. since we've been talking a lot about um, weekend getaways, might I add that this week's episode of Project Runway was designing for yes. the weekend getaway. <laughs> so go have a weekend getaway. Right and we're tired of hearing the excuses, too. I can't travel because I don't have money. Or, oh, I've got kids. Or, Stop with the excuse. <laughs> go do it. Go do it. I've got a new baby. Strap the baby on your back. Yeah. Go do it. If we can take Elizabeth, yeah. anybody can go anywhere. Exactly. That's a big chore. Just go do it. Go do it. No excuses. Have an adventure. Have yeah. a weekend getaway. And not, we're not talking Seattle and Portland. No. Go make it fun. Go somewhere big. Yeah. All right. Stop hating on the Ryan one. We're going to have to, I'm going to have Ryan send us pictures and we'll do a. Have Ryan do a, um, a guest oh, vlog. Yeah, I guess one. adventures. Jennifer did, yeah, yeah, Jennifer did one of those for us from Bali. Yeah. He'll do one for us from New Zealand. Anyways, if you won't go see the world, I'll share it with you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and if you need cool friends to go have adventures with, Contact us. Oh, we'll find someone in your area. <laughs> <laughs> and help us out. I think we start a foundation. Or we should. A foundation for people that need to go travel. So far, I like to start foundation. We should. <laughs> foundation Wait. coming. So stop hating the weekend getaway and have one of your own. All right. Ciao. Bye. Aloha. <laughs>